Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. His name is MyWeb, and in this video, I'm just going to make this website as a mobile view responsive website. Just because so many people told me to make this video for uh, how to make this website as a responsive view. So when I uh, press the F12 or when I go to the inspect element and choose the device is uh, near about 360 pixel device width it's not looking good uh, it's view like a computer view computer device view so just uh, simply going back to your HTML file um, and before the title tag just take a meta tag which name is viewport and uh, the content and set the width sorry, equal to device width comma the initial state sorry scale not state initial scale is near about 1.0 okay now press the control s and check in the browser now that view is uh, set with the mobile device with but it's not looking so good okay so uh, I t make a new file in the CSS folder which is which name is media.css file media.css file and implement this CSS file into your HTML file so link and the hyper reference is CSS and the media.css file okay now I'm going back to my media media.css file add direct media screen and the maximum width is near about 500 pixel ok now let's see uh, so our first target is search box so I click on the inspect element yeah and the search box is is near about 360 pixel okay uh, I think before fixing this search box uh, we just need to decrease the size of logo so what is the class of logo just check it out the dot logo img okay so dot logo img selector and the width is near about 120 pixel uh, okay I take it take it as the 130 pixel okay let's see okay and take a margin from top near about 20 or 30 pixel so from the margin the margin from top is 20 pixel okay yeah now uh, decrease the size of the search box and other things here is the search area box and yeah so fix the, this uh, 60 pixel search box search area and uh, search box is also 360 pixel and yeah okay yeah mm, I think it's not fixing that okay let's see go user menu uh, let's fix this user menu okay we just uh, it's I think it's fixed now so the size of that user menu is near about 200 pixel and take a position 
I think we need that take a position which is a uh, position absolute the position is absolute okay sorry position is absolute and the from top is or right is zero okay as you can see here is uh, my account okay so let's fix it is into your media dot CSS file so dot user hyphen menu and width is 200 pixel and the height sorry for that uh, yeah the height is 60 pixel position is absolute and uh, from the right is 0 okay and set this of width of that ally tags as you can see that oh uh, yeah here is our user menu and evil and in under the evil we have ally tag so dot user hyphen menu ul and ally the width is divided into 90 pixel 90 pixel okay yeah and set the font size according to your mobile device is near about 12 pixel okay press the control s and save it and refresh As you can see that uh, the our user menu is also looking so good. Okay, user account, user order, and other things. Okay. Mm. Yeah, it's good. Now fix this uh, the search area and search box. So uh, here is our search hyphen area and does what what is then class name of search underscore box okay now dot search hyphen area the width is 360 pixel uh, I think it's it fixed into the important because it's over right on that and from margin left Mm, minus 14 pixel yeah that's good now from margin top is mm, yeah I, I don't think it's from margin top near about 10 pixel okay yeah margin top is near about 10 pixel now it's time to set the size of search box so dot search underscore box the width is 360 pixel I think it's also overrated on that this is important yeah refresh can't see that where is it mm. okay mm. okay S uh, slider area just check it Float left okay I got the search box okay so dot slider area class slider area and the float is left 
refresh okay uh, as you can see that uh, our search box is now visible uh, but uh, the search button is now missing so let's see okay what is the class name of search button is search underscore btn okay yeah cool class name search underscore btn and the margin left yeah margin left minus 40 pixel refresh mm, okay let's check and here is our search button yeah yeah okay Okay, minus forty three pixels. Okay, it's looking good. Okay. Not now it's time to fix the size of that slider so slider height slider area set the height is near about 250 pixel and it's have margin some margin so margin from top is near about minus 10 pixel refresh okay now fix the size of that search area image size so what we have uh, slider area and it's have slider and have image okay so dot slider area dot slider and it's have img tag okay and the height also will be equal to his parents size which is height is 250 pixel Okay, it's cool. Mm, yeah, uh, as you can see that our product slider is not looking so good. So also fix that. Mm, I think we just need to fix that product section. Okay, where is that? Yeah. Here is our content fluid and here is the section which class name is product section dot product hyphen section yes it is floating point is left control s to save and f5 for refresh as you can see that our products product cards is now looking good okay uh, the slider text and another buttons is not looking good uh, suitable for this sli uh, slider so now fix that mm, what see we have coming back to your slider content yeah slider content s3 and anchor tags okay inspect and here is slider content oh 
width it is the size of width is near about 300 pixel and the front top is 130 pixel and from the left is 50 pixel let's see okay okay copy all the things or type manually in into your text editor so dot slider content the width is 300 pixel and the front top is 120 or 30 pixel and the from the left position position from left is only 50 pixel and we have s3 heading so dot slider i find content s3 the font size is 15 pixel control to save and refresh yeah it's looking good Mm, now coming back to your product cards mm, okay here is a product card and set the margin and and the things so from the margin from the top and left is 10 and on left and right is fix it pixel okay dot product card set the margin 10 pixel and from the left to the right is 30 pixel refresh okay yeah so as you can see that our our mobile section uh, uh, view is looking so good and it's also suitable with your mobile device okay so i hope guys you like this video and in the next part we will be we are working on the admin panel so let's meet in the next video bye bye thank you and say with me happy coding